Here we have our goblet, and we need a foot for it or a rondelle, which is nothing more than just a glass disc that you mount it on. And that's what we're going to be making today in this video. Uh, some things I want to point out to you first is that your point has to be straight, okay? And when you attach your punny rod, it has to be dead center and in line with the blowpipe. Everything has to be perfectly centered and balanced because we're going to take this and spin it out in the flame. And if anything's out of balance, then you will end up with a lopsided rondelle. We start out with the onion shape, and I've already prepared this to try to save a little bit of time. So I've blown out my onion shape, and uh, you want this to be as flat as possible down here on the punty rod side, because that's less glass you have to, to uh, spin out. So we'll start out by cutting off the blowpipe, opening it up a little bit, and then we'll spin it out. Take the blowpipe off just like we did on the goblet. Heat it up right here at the base. Get it red hot. This is put my glasses on. So I don't go blind. And I'll bring it back to my marver and use that for support. And I'll constrict it down just a little bit. And then as the color leaves it, then I'll start crimping it. And I'll do stress into it. And that's why I do that over the bench because sometimes it pops off right then and there. And that hole needs to be round, centered, and square. Okay. I've got all those things. And I'm going to take my jacks. I'm going to open this hole up a little bit so it doesn't close up on me when I heat it up in the big flame. You need a long punny rod for this too, by the way, because the big flame is going to get hot and you want some length between you and the flame. Now I have it opened up. Probably what three quarters of an inch, I'd say. Now we're going to put it in the flame and start heating it. We're going to have to get evenly heated. We're going to hold the uh, rod parallel to the work surface. And then we'll start spinning it a little faster, opening it up. And I have three forces working in my favor. I've got this horizontal or parallel to the work surface. I've got gravity. I've got centrifugal force because I'm spinning this thing as fast as I can. And then I'm going to turn it into the flame and the pressure of the flame will also help open it up. And I'm going to keep spinning, keep spinning. I'll bring it down. Flatten it just a little bit on the table surface or your marble. Then I'll take my holding my claw grabbers, warm them up a little bit. Then I'll cut my rod off. I'm gonna leave about a half inch on there. So I can make my havolio.
Whip it up, heat that stub till it forms a ball. And I'll bring it vertical. I'm going to adjust my flame and now I'll attach that to my goblet. I just want to heat it just enough to make the connection. Red to red, it's got to be heated red to red. But I don't want to heat any more glass than needed to make this connection. Straighten it out a little bit. Then I'll remove my claw grabbers. I'll bring it down on the work surface. Make sure it's straight. And there we have our finished goblet. Thanks for watching.